Hi, it's Ben from Ticketmaster. I'm here backstage at Reading Festival with the guys from Counterfeit. Um, can I just get you guys to introduce yourselves to the audience? I'm Jamie. I'm Sam. I'm Roland. Cool. Um, how are you finding, I know it's quite early in the day, you haven't been here for very long, but how are you finding your Reading Festival experience so far? Amazing. This is the first time I've ever been. Even, um, even as a punter? Well. Even as a punter, yeah. It was a festival that always um, unfortunately passed me by, so I'm just stoked to be here. It's great. Yeah, buzzing. Buzzing. We just got here and I'm kind of, yeah. Boiling, sweating. Sweating. <laughs> very sweaty. It, it, you guys have played festivals before. I mean, how do, you, how do you feel about the festival environment compared to your own shows? I mean, obviously for us, you know, a festival show, um, we're going to be playing to a lot more people who may not necessarily have heard of the band before. So for us, we kind of just go out there and we do, you know, we do what we would do at a headline show um, and just go as hard as we possibly can. I think it's always a vibe as well. There's always much more of a sort of like community spirit, I think, at a festival, obviously, because people are sort of staying together and living together for four or five days, you know, yeah. out of the week, which is great, you know. It's, it's, it's good to have the pressure to have to like win people over. You know, a headline show, it's our show, we're in control, like everyone's there. And it's nice to put pressure on yourself at festivals to kind of get out and yeah. have to, you know, deliver because everyone else is. So it's a bit of a more of a challenge, I guess, doing these ones. In a way, yeah, in a way. It's like the pressure's all, I guess the pressure's always high. It's always, always special. <laughs> yeah, yeah. um, and how's that, I mean, how's life been since releasing your, your debut record, which you released in earlier this year, right? Yeah, um, how How are you feeling about it now, a few months later? Amazing, yeah. yeah. Good. It's pretty much been it's been pretty non-stop since we released it. We kind of released it and then went out and did a did a headline Europe and UK run. Then kind of came straight off that and went into festivals pretty much. And so I'm not sure if I've really had the time to decompress and kind of sit back yeah. and go, okay, it's. I mean, maybe that time will come. I'm not sure if I'm ever going to be ready for that though. <laughs> if it does, but yeah. You'll be working on the next one by then, right? I mean, are you working on a new record already? Yeah, we're, we're, we're in beginning stages. I mean, uh, we're, we're actually moving into a house altogether um, very soon. So, you know, we're going to be working on stuff in there and, you know, living. Doing so, so that'll be make or break then, right? When you're all in the same place. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it'll <laughs> either go really well or really badly. We'll find out. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm touring. I mean, what, what's your favourite thing about being on the road? What do you look forward to when you're heading out there? Um, Sam's shorts and our drummer Jimmy's shorts. I, I, if we're in the splitter, I sit opposite them. So there's it's a nice neon pink and green that, you know, always keeps my mood up. Nice. So uh, uh, party shorts. Party <laughs> shorts, <laughs> indeed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Pajamas, Ro and I have got matching, well, not matching we pajamas, will, we will. but we've got. What we need is matching pajamas. Yeah. We'll just we'll into a sartorial. Yeah. Well, I'll be wearing on tour a. <laughs> it's that, it sounds like you guys need cameras in your house when you're all living together. There's a reality TV show in here somewhere, right? That sounds terrifying. Yeah. <laughs> oh, bad idea. Bad idea? Bad idea. Not, not gonna happen. No, the best part of touring is like playing every night. Playing every night. We've been very lucky and we've been out to Europe quite a few times. And, you know, it's great to be able to explore new territories. And we've been, since the album came out like five months ago, just been trying to play as many new places as we can and do as much as we can, really. And I think, you know, we're, we're really enjoying how it's going and giving it 110%, so. It's, it's hard to do, I mean, it's sorry, it's hard to define, though, like, what is the best thing about touring? Because actually, in general, like, I feel like this band, yeah, this band lives to be on the road. Like, it's where we feel happiest. It's like, when, I, when we're off for, like, even if it's just a week, I start to lose my mind a bit. So being out on the road is like totally where I definitely feel the most comfortable for sure. Um, and you're doing a show with Don Broco, uh, Ali Pali. Yeah. Uh, how are you? How are you feeling about that? Have you all seem quite excited? Yeah, stoked. It's like a venue that I I, I don't know. I always wanted to play, but so to, to like to have the opportunity is amazing. And they're out there smashing it at the moment. So it'll be good to, to get there. State champs as well. You know, bands we listen to and. Big respect to them, so yeah. It's, yeah, it's a good opportunity. It's, it's got it's Palace well. in the name as well, so <laughs> after that, You're it's Buckingham and like <laughs> St. James. St. James, yeah. So you heard it here first, it's the Palace tour is the next yeah. one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Only <laughs> very streetwear, very streetwear. <laughs> yeah. um, and are you going to be bringing anything special to that show? Have you, have you had time to think about it, or are you waiting until you get through festival season first? Um, I mean, yeah, I, I'd like to definitely take elements and do and do something cool and do something big. We've got a couple of months, you know, yet until the show, so we'll have to sit back and like take our time over what it exactly is that we're going to be able to do. But yeah, we'd like to do something special for sure. Cool, excellent. Well, we look forward to it. Thank you very much for your time chatting to us, and enjoy the rest of Reading. <laughs>